In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use the header and navigation options. These can be found inside the Appearances Customizer tab. So when you log into your WordPress dashboard, go to Appearances and then Customize. And this will launch the Theme Customizer. You can see a preview of your website on the right and all your theme options um, within the Customizer on the left. And there's a couple settings that apply to header and navigation um, specifically. So first of all, under Theme Settings, you can choose to have your header either be on the top or on the left. So if you enable vertical navigation, it's going to take your header and place it over here on the left instead. And this can really uh, drastically change the feel of your site, which is really cool. Um, I'm going to put it back at the top. And then if you want to, you can also choose how your text and logo is oriented. So if you choose center, it's going to center it, which is also pretty cool. Um, within the header, you can um, add contact info. So if you add a phone number, And these will display in the header. So, example, if I save and publish and take a look at my site now, you can see um, the contact info has been added up in the secondary navigation bar area. So, there's several uh, pieces of information that are relegated to this area. So, if you enable secondary nav or you add contact info, um, it's going to be displayed up here in the secondary nav. So, it, just to keep things from being too cluttered. So, there's certain things that will appear in your main nav area and certain things that will appear in the secondary nav. So we can go back to the customizer. You can also choose the text color for your primary and secondary nav bar areas. So depending on the colors you're, you're using, you want to change your text to be either light or dark so that it shows up on the background color you're using. And then um, we can also go over various navigation options. So down in the na navigation tab, you have some more options. So there's three navigation bar areas. We've already seen the primary one, which is where your logo and your primary nav is. The secondary nav, which is this blue area. So I can um, add a secondary navigation menu here. Um, once you've created a menu in the Appearances menu um, section in your WordPress dashboard, you'll have the option to apply it to either the primary or secondary nav area. So under the secondary nav option here, I'm going to select um, one of my menus. And here you go. It's been added to the top here to the right. And you can also add it to the footer. So uh, select footer and scroll down. And yeah, here it's been added to the footer as well. So there's three navigation bar areas. You can also adjust the colors of, of these, like I was uh, saying before. So under the colors section, you can choose your secondary uh, nav bar color. So they, you can see it changing here if I want to make it green instead of blue. And you can adjust the primary as well, whatever you want. And if I happen to make the primary a dark color like that blue, you're probably going to want to go back to your theme settings and change your primary nav uh, color to light so that your text shows up. There you go. So that's what those options are for. And that's a basic overview of um, the header and navigation options.